Hi guys, uh, welcome to another vlog. <laughs> oh my God. I, um, I'm literally starting this vlog right off from where I left. Where is that dog and what is she? <gasps> She's on the bed. I knew she was too quiet. Get off there. Oh my God, I think she's cold. Um, okay, I definitely think she's cold because I'm feeling it as well. And the reason why I decided to pick up the camera and oh, I need to sit down, start the vlog literally from where I just left. I've just been um, editing it for you guys tomorrow. I went to stand up to get a snack because it's the afternoon and I'm hungry and go to the bathroom. I could not stand up properly. I can't walk properly. And oh, it's freezing. I think the reason why is because I've been doing these flat packs for the last two days and I've been sitting really badly on the ground. And I, I haven't worked out or done ballet or anything active since I moved here in January and oh my god I can feel it in my body and I am shaking because I'm so cold I want to go get into bed with the dog I'm gonna go put on the um cozy oody that uh Chris's mum purchased for me and I'm gonna get a snack and then I'm gonna go back to editing the last vlog oh god Pray for me. It's actually, it's not that cold today. It's like 19 degrees here, but um, it's cold in the house. The house stays cool. I'm gonna go cuddle the dog. Guys, I just found the box with all of the things that I've been hunting for literally since we moved into this house. And it has been right in front of my face the whole time. Well, not really. It's kind of been tucked into a corner. Uh, but it contains all of the things that I've been struggling to find. And by all of the things, I mean like two things that I've been desperately needing. So this box has been tucked away in our laundry. Um, I don't need this. This is fine. Um, what I do need so badly is the sticky roller because little miss, look at her tufts. Look at her tufts of hair. She's shedding. It's shedding season, right? That's... That's fine. Um, but also, it's shedding season and I couldn't find her brush. And I've just found it. I finally, finally found it. There's also some toys and stuff in there. I am going to, I was just vacuuming. Chris is on his way home. Um, and I, I haven't actually vacuumed since we moved in. And obviously, a Little Miss is shedding. And the floors aren't bad. Um, there are some little hair fluffs. It's more the carpets that I think um, it's deceptive how much hair gets on them. So since I'm kind of having like a chilled out morning just using my new favourite vacuum cleaner, by the way, this shark, oh my god, it's so good for pet hair and human hair. Anyway, was vacuuming, saw this box and thought, why have... I thought it was empty. Um, I thought it just had, here's our messy uh, utility slash linen closet. I thought it just had these in it, which had like, um, you know, pillows and stuff in it from when we moved from Geraldton. And I was like, why have I just not emptied that out and taken the box outside? So I moved them and then I was like, oh, that's where you've been hiding also your toys are in there did you know dad your toys is it a squeaky one we're about to find out there she goes off i go yay got to my ball i got it yes it's a good one is it squeaky or not if it's squeaky i'll go it's squeaky good okay I'm going to vacuum to drown her out, but first I'm going to empty this box. Huzzah! Oh, by the way, have you watched The Great? My God, it's so funny. You can obviously tell it's stuck in my head. We found this at the supermarket and I'm about to try it. Oh, it stinks. 
Oh, the baby, that doesn't smell good. Mm -hmm. This is the tropical punch flavor. Oh, sweet. Oh my god, that is holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> oh, I just got diabetes. Is that just like 90% sugar? It's got to be. That's so, so sweet. And I like sweet stuff. If you don't know what that is, by the way, um, that is it Logan Paul and KSI. KSI, yeah. yeah. Um, they brought out a, I don't even know what it is. I don't think it's an energy drink. I think it's meant to be like, I don't know. If you read the... I'll read the bottle in a sec. It has one gram of sugar per serve. And there's got to be another sweetener in there. Unless one serve is um, a sip. No, per 100 mils is less than a gram. No. Yeah. There's another artificial sweetener in there. Or not, That's... maybe a natural sweetener. It does have that flavour of... If you know, you know. Water, fruit juice from concentrated coconut, food acid, acidity regulators, colours from vegetable juice, beta carotene, sweeteners, sweeteners. Uh, sacralose, something, yep. potassium, and a bunch of other stuff. Vitamin um. E, vitamin B. It's actually not that bad for you. <laughs> well, I mean, it's not great for you. No. Yeah, it's got vitamin A, E, B6, B12. Yeah, it's, a, it's supposed to be like, it's an electrolyte drink. Yeah. It's a sports drink. Like, I, I get where they're going with it. Yeah. Jesus. You want to finish it, baby? No, I don't. Yeah, there's oh, there's two, um, two, sweeteners, two in there. sweeteners in there. I like it. Far out, dude. That's crazy. That's surprising. That. Yeah. Um... So we saw them yesterday at Woolworths and most of them were sold out. So we grabbed, I think actually all the flavors were sold out except the Tropical Punch and would not recommend. It's super sweet. It doesn't need to be that sweet. But what's going on? Chris is obviously home, which is really, really nice. Um, I'm super tired. I somehow managed to get myself out of bed today it's sunday when i'm filming this and i did a live video um that should still be up when this goes up so if you want to go and watch it you can i just don't leave them up for long um and pretty much in that live uh we had a fashion show courtesy of chris my hair is falling out don't know if you can see that um Freya was hectic and crazy and I demonstrated how bad my memory is at the moment by not being able to uh, talk about a subject for more than like a minute at a time. <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm so, so tired. I'm just like... I don't know, just worn out. Um, it's been it's been a crazy year, but I'm kind of trying to take the rest of the day easy. I do need to go down to the shops. Uh, we're having a family lunch type thing tomorrow, and we're hosting it at our place. So I've got to go pick some stuff up for that. But yeah, I think I just need today to be an a non day because I'm tired. I'm finally doing something that I've been putting off doing mostly because I didn't want to film it, but I want to film it. <laughs> you get what I'm trying to say here. Um, filming it is a pain in the butt, but I want to film it because I know you guys want to see it. So I'm filming it. I'm getting there <laughs> kind of, but if you can't tell i'm in my bathroom this is what's happening so i'm cleaning out this i've taken the stuff out of the bottom and wiped it out and i just took the stuff out of the top and wiped it out uh i've done kind of in here i can't show you there's stuff in the way but i'm doing it which is just one step closer to sort of getting this little mini series that i'm creating done which is awesome but it's a big job I'm not gonna lie and it's kind of hard to do it when you're like 
tucked here in a tiny, tiny little corner with a camera to your left and lights above you because it we're having the weirdest, gloomiest weather out there. It, it's hailed like three times today, so and it's been raining for three days. Apparently, there's been some flooding around Perth. I don't know because I've just been trying to stay home and mind my own damn business. This is chaos. Chaos, 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 chaos. Although, starting to look organized. One thing I will, <laughs> one thing I will say, drawers are so much better. So much better for storing stuff like this. Unless you have like a really like normal person amount of beauty products, it's so much better to store things um, in drawers. <laughs> So, Chris and his dad put the dryer just up on top of the washing machine today because it's been raining so much. Um, these clothes have been on the line for like uh, three days and they're just like getting soaked. So anyway, they put it up and I just come in to like check, you know, are they dry? No, they're not quite dry yet. They weren't really, we should have put them in like a a spin cycle to get the excess water off them before we put them in but <gasps> I was looking down here and I'm like why is it wet did someone leave the door open rain what no it's condensation from this look at it it's on the wall so <laughs> is that weird Freya you've never seen that before have you it's weird uh, we will certainly be uh, spinning off any excessively wet clothes in the future. Anyway, okay, back to work. Come on, let's go. We've got stuff to do. Okay, so I'm not done in here, but I think I'm going to call it quits for today. I've done a bit. So there were a bunch of boxes up here, which you guys would have seen in the past. They've pretty much all been unpacked. That actually has some empties and some items that I want to declutter in it. So that'll be, you know, for a video. Eventually I'll find some way to put that. And I'll probably put it in uh, one of these, which I used to keep it in. This is stuff that uh, I still need to sort out. I have a plan, but I kind of need to sit down and, you know, look up the item that I think will help to store these better and do some measurements, blah, 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 blah. Um, this is like body, body, all of it, hands, uh, hair. I, this is not going to work. Like I just, it's not, <laughs> it would be fine if I had like two or three bottles of shampoo and conditioner. And if I only had two or three bottles of shampoo and conditioner, they'd all be in my shower. Like I'm just putting it out there. Uh, but I don't. Um, I've also got a bunch of styling products. To be fair, a lot of them are really small, which is great. I think down the track, um, what I might do, uh, Ikea sell these sort of, um, they're these trays that essentially, uh, it's like a little stand. You can put products under it, products on top. It creates like a mini shelf. I'm thinking I might get a couple of them. Might be useful for some of this stuff the drawers were never perfect at home but it was certainly easier to organize things because you just laid the things down that wouldn't stand up and then you'd stand up the things that would uh and it was super easy to find stuff whereas with this it's like yeah it's, i mean you can see it's dark back there i mean i know what a lot of the products are simply by their packaging but also there's some things that are kind of new to me. Like if this was back there somewhere, I wouldn't even notice it. This is new to my stash and, you know, I'm not familiar with it. But like the Tiggy bedhead back there, I recognize that. I know that that's the Drunk Elephant um, detangling spray. So, you know, it's mm, like there's a bottle of something back there. No idea what it is. So for me to get to it, I have to like pull everything out. So I'm actually not too sure what this is going to be like. 
um, maybe difficult, maybe not, because obviously my goal is not to keep it like this, it's to minimize it. So in my head, I think it's okay, it'll get easier over time. Problem is, guess what? Guess what? This isn't all of it. I'm pretty sure there's still some in the filming room that I just haven't gotten around to pull it, like putting in this room yet because it wouldn't fit. Like this was all full of boxes. So yeah, we're gonna see. We'll see how we go. I also have a mess here. This is to go back into the filming room. Um, I have sort of started earmarking what these drawers will be for. Um, this one's for dental. The one on the bottom is for um, like my hair dryer and hair tools. And then I've got pads and tampons in that one until I decide uh, if I can find something, I don't know, like a little drawer set or something. I say, I don't want to buy anything. I don't want to buy stuff. I don't want to. I don't want to spend money on things like that. I don't, <laughs> I don't want to spend money on stuff like that because I spent years like, you know, tweaking my organization um, in Melbourne. And to me, it feels like I'm going backwards uh, by buying more organization stuff. So there's that, but it's fine. Eventually I'll get my head around it. What I find with uh, beauty storage, makeup storage, stuff like that is often you have to like live with your stuff before you come up with ways of making it better for yourself when it comes to like storage and finding stuff and things like that. So I'm just gonna live with this for a little while. I also like, I need to pull stuff out for panning. So, you know, it's good. I think it'll get better. It'll get better. I just gotta live with it for a little while. Um, but until then, I'm gonna, clean this up this is somebody send the cleaning fairy i don't know where she is but send her my way also i have to give you a really like crappy shot of what's going on here but mum sent me three boxes and they're quite light i can see some of my favorite jumpers in there so they have uh jumpers and stuff i can't i can't show you them properly because they've got my address on them and mum's address so you know Let's not dox ourselves. Again, I've done it before. Guys, it's finally happening. We are going to do the, the things that we need to do. Buy some of the things that have been on our list. I'm going to Ikea. It's happening. How do you feel, babe? Good. Good. <laughs> You're going to purchase a big clock, <laughs> clock. A large wall clock. We are buying a, uh, buying a clock. Yes, we are buying a clock. <laughs> He's very pleased with himself. It wouldn't be a vlog with Chris in it if if there wasn't something inappropriate said. Okay, off to Ikea, followed by like Kmart and maybe Bunnings. And I don't know, we'll see. Oh no, we're done. We're finished. <laughs> we're finished at Ikea and I forgot to vlog. But we've got a few things, so that's good. Um, I can actually see something else that I want to get, which I will go, look, I'll show you when we get home, okay? I'll try to remember to vlog at Kmart. We're at Bunnings. I'm trying to catch up to Chris. He's going to get black gloves. He walked all the way to the other end of the store. I got a piece of Corflu tape for jigsaw puzzles. <laughs> to be fair, I can do them on the dining table, but this is nice if I want to do them in bed because it's cold, you know? I fucked up. I didn't vlog in Kmart. Hey, baby. <laughs> yeah? You fucked up. You didn't vlog in Kmart. <gasps> I know. Uh, we bought things in Kmart. We did. We bought things. I'll show you when we get home. It's probably the easiest way to do it. We were trying to sort of like get in and out before school traffic starts like after school traffic uh it's 10 to 3 now so yeah we were like you know let's let's get what we need and let's gtfo uh and we did we got what we need probably didn't get 
everything that we needed, but we got the majority of the things on our list. Okay, we are home. That was productive. Uh, the bin is on the bench, um, which tells you the dog is still being a problem. <laughs> so today we went and sorted that. We got one of these. Um, it's the laundry hamper cabinet. It's just from Kmart. Freya has to inspect everything. Um, get out of it, miss. Um, so you can actually convert these into double-sided bins, which we're going to do. We went to Bunnings, got the 27 litre bins. So we got two of them. I also picked up some hangers. I think this should be the last of what I need, but I'm not sure. Um, we did go to Ikea. I got one of these. Yes. This is like the one at home, Freya. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is. So this is one of their all seasons blankets. Um, or you get, it's technically two. Look at it. Excuse me. It's got, uh, this is a duck feather and down, I believe. Look. <laughs> it's not a toy. <laughs> Really? Does it smell that good? <laughs> She's gonna harm it. <laughs> no, okay, uh uh. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, yeah, all right, just getting into everything. Let me just put a hole in it. Um, no, ah, uh -uh. no. Now I've got to stop laughing enough to tell her no. So, um, no, Freya, it's not for you. Sit. I know, you're very excited. We haven't even been gone long. Good girl, good girl. Um, it is one of the, like, twin blankets. So if you've never seen these... You've got like a light one and a heavier one and they clip together and they become like an extra thick blanket. So we got that in a king size or Ikea's king size. Uh, picked up a couple of extra towels because uh, we, don't, we don't have enough for like if we have guests. So we got towels. I also got um, like face towels we just got four of them and also some hand towels we changed up the colors on them a little bit uh it would not be an ikea trip if you didn't just so we're clear also picked up a couple of these i got four of these little ikea bags these are the best grocery shopping bags ever and i'm pretty sure they're like a dollar each oh and meatballs I don't know where the other Ikea receipt is. Doesn't matter. They're great bags. They're just fantastic. Um, we were going to have lunch at Ikea. All right, Freya, come on. Out. Out. Good girl. We were going to have lunch at Ikea. Chris has never eaten there. Um, and I said, like, look, you have to eat at Ikea at least once. But the best thing is definitely their meatballs. And we can just buy a packet of them and have them at home. So one day we will eat at Ikea, but we we went to um, Grilled instead. Oh, Freya, did you see what's in there? Oh, look. Is it something for you? It's not for you. I'm sorry, girl. I'm sorry. Uh, light globes. Needed light globes. That's fine. Excellent. And we got a couple of um, slightly better ones or brighter ones for the bedroom because the one in our bedroom is quite dim. We picked up a couple of these lighters because we can't find the ones that Chris had and it's hard to light the barbecue and all that jazz. Uh, a couple of command hooks. These are for the bathroom. We also got some gardening gloves for Chris and I. 
Oh, is there something under there? No, that's fine. And two of the bins. So just like a few things ticking off the list. I don't think I'll put this together today. I think I'll start on it tomorrow. Not start on it, but I'll do it tomorrow. Because uh, I still need to edit a vlog. Hopefully I have enough footage. Otherwise you guys will be seeing this on Sunday instead. Um, but yeah, I'm going to clean this up. I did also pick up an Alex chest of drawers from Ikea. So these are the shorter, wider ones. Um, I got the wood grain finish and I'm going to do something to it to make it like fit a little bit. You guys can tell like I'm kind of going for that like black and wood vibe with some pops of colour. Um, so I'm going to do a little DIY to this. But I mean look at this room. I can't show you too much over here because I don't want to give away my address. Um, it's really bad. I've been going through boxes and um, I'll find like the specific thing that I'm looking for but then I'll find like other little bits and I'll pull them out and be like oh yeah just in case I need that um, and again like same things happened over here so yeah everything's just oh my god even Freya's embarrassed oh no oh no I have to teach you how to put your paw over your face don't look don't look, I'm so embarrassed. Um, I think this will be something else that I focus on tomorrow as well. Yeah, it's not very nice walking in here. <laughs> uh, also, I did get a replacement mirror. Um, and I... Look, I kind of ripped through the box to because I wanted to get it out and make sure that it worked. Um, and we were in the middle of a family lunch, so I just kind of ripped it out and Chris came in and just helped me and we plugged it in and then ran back uh, to family lunch but the remnants the messy remnants are still there so I've got a lot to like clean up okay let's just leave this room shall we bedroom might test that out while I've got you guys so the one in the bedroom look it doesn't need replacing it's just a bit kind of like it doesn't really offer a lot of light in room I'm not sure if it's currently dimmed at all no that's like as bright as it goes um I haven't looked at the color of the bulb. I think it might be a warm bulb. We got cool white because I think that's always 
the safest when you're putting it in a lampshade like this because the lampshade will throw some color anyway so let's see if we can improve that Better. That is better. Moving. Stop moving. It's better. I feel like it looks wonky now. Like I've I've done something to it. Hang on. I don't know what I did. Oh no. Maybe it's all right. I don't know. That was actually quite difficult to put up. Um. It's a very like it's a tiny light globe. Um, and I just don't think it was ever going to give us the light that we wanted from it. So, well, they're not designed to. Small wattage uh, usually means not so bright. Um, but I think that's okay. Yeah, I think, I think it'll be a bit better. We might also replace the lampshade because I am quite sure that the lampshade is not actually um, helping our cause when it comes to kind of giving the room more light in the evening. It's mostly like, look, usually when we've got the light on in here, we're not really doing anything that like, neither of us have read in bed or anything like that. Um, and if we are, then we're doing it on our phones. So they got give off their own light, but I think um, when a room is kind of dim, it you just naturally like start to sort of strain your eyes and be like, oh, I can't see in here properly. Um, so we both prefer a bit more light. So I think that will do. I will get Chris to have a look, see what he thinks. But I think he's yeah, he's in a key. So later um okay i think that's all i'm going to do with you guys today uh i think it's not all i'm gonna do i'm gonna go and uh uh edit this vlog hope that i have enough footage we'll, we'll see if you guys are watching this when it first goes up on thursday my time maybe wednesday depending on where you are in the world uh, then you know that I decided there was enough footage. And if you're not, then <laughs> you're seeing it on another day and I felt like there wasn't enough footage. So we'll leave it at that. All right, guys, I'm going to leave it there. Um, and I'll catch you in the next one.